Millions across the country and state observed Memorial Day today, a day to remember those who died while serving their country. Fishermen and military service members gathered this afternoon for a ceremony in Cayucas. KSPY News reporter Austin Herba takes us there. Dozens of people gathered at the Cayucas Pier for the Lost at Sea Memorial, which honors both members of the armed services as well as civilians who never made it home. I have lost a lot of fellow fishermen out to sea. The grief of losing a loved one or a close friend is an experience shared by many who spend their lives at sea. It's honoring those people that are lost that you sometimes don't have a chance to bury because there's not a body to bury. A crowd gathered at the Cayucas Pier on Monday to honor lives lost to the ocean, both military and civilian. We ask that you now take a moment of silence and reflection. The ceremony started with a moment of silence followed by the national anthem. Veterans from different branches of the military spoke and showed up in uniform to pay tribute and continue a decades-long career of serving others. Giving something back to other people doesn't cost me anything but a few minutes of my time. And I'm blessed with the ability to communicate that to people. Jim Murphy served in Korea and rose through the ranks of the Marine Corps. They promoted me to a second lieutenant, a temporary officer, and I thought, no, oh, this is not bad. It's better than going home and raising hogs, so I, I stayed in the Marine Corps. I come from a family that have all served. Donna Archer served as a nurse in the Air Force during the Gulf War in the early 1990s. I was an adult myself, and I always, I thought, I'm going to serve, and I and I got into the reserves and the next thing I know, Desert Shield and Desert Storm was happening and I got called up for that. Donna and Jim were chosen this year to carry the wreath to the end of the Cayucas Pier. I think touching, it has a, a meaning of putting some closure on things. This will provide some comfort and some peace as the wreath is then committed to the sea. <laughs> The Estrella Warbirds flew over to mark the special occasion. This is the most special day out of my life. I would not be anywhere else on Memorial Day. Now the Lost at Sea Memorial happens every year on Memorial Day at 3 in the afternoon here at the Cayucas Pier. Reporting in Cayucas, Austin Herbach, KSPY News.